Michael, a big three points, a big performance from the squad tonight. You must be delighted with that. Yeah, it was about passion and desire. Uh, our quality got better as the game went on. I thought at the start of the game we showed a little bit of a lack of belief at times with the ball. Our desire was always there out of it. I'm proud of the team tonight. You know, at half time I said to him it was going to be a big second half moment in the season where we had to stand up and be counted for. And I thought the goal typified the passion really. We won three or four balls in the box. We were the hungrier team. And that's won the night for us. We had it at the post, we had it at the bar, we had Rabi had a big chance first half. So on the balance of chances, I think we deserved it and rightly got the 1-0 win. Like you say there, I think you could really feel that the team growing into the game tonight. And, and was that the message at half-time to sort of continue that into the second half and, and keep pushing? Yeah, we have to commit, you know, really, really commit against a team like Real Betis. They're a good side and in these, in these close games, it's important that we come out the other side of it. There's been a few close games in big matches where we've been found wanting in the small details. And tonight it was important and that's what we spoke about at half-time coming out the side of it. There's loads of things we've got to improve on. There's loads of things we've got to work on, me and the players. But we can't be short of effort and passion and desire. And I think that's what won it tonight. I thought we were a stronger team as the game went on. After we scored, we got a little bit anxious at times and sat back in. But then I thought Ben and Connor in the back four, it's another clean sheet for them. Jack Butland played well again. That's a big step in the right direction, but it's just one step. And now it, we, we really have to kick on with this week with the three home games. Yeah, and the goal, another goal from a set piece as well, which must be pleasing. Really pleasing because in tight games, they're the things that can win it for you. And the biggest thing for me as we won the first three or four contacts, the keeper makes a fantastic save from Kamar. But loads of people involved in that Ben and Seema, you know, fighting each other to score. And uh, I'm not sure who's got the final touch, but that just shows the desire of the team was stronger than Betis in that moment. And it's decisive tonight. And uh, them small details go a long way. And hopefully now we push on. But what we must do is enjoy tonight and tomorrow get ready for Motherwell. You touch on the, the passion of the squad as well. And, and it was really felt in the stands tonight too. They, they got behind the team and, and kept, kept going. Yeah, I think they react to the players on the pitch and certainly, you know, I don't think they understand how much they can help us as well. But I thought that was a, a team effort, if you like, and that's how we want Ibrox to be. That's how we need it on Saturday, or sorry, Sunday as well. What can this result do for the squad in terms of confidence moving forward? Well, I think that the big thing is when you're a new player coming into Ibrox and, and playing in big games like tonight to get the result and feel the, the feeling of what it is to play for this club, I think that will help everybody. It's another clean sheet. We've been quietly collecting them and it's important that we continue that this week. I think the big thing is just the feeling of a group and being a team that wins important games and it's just one game out of six. We now have two away games in this competition and we're going to need to uh, improve further as we go.